Hello, today I'm going to help you with instrument definition files and how to install them in the new Cakewalk by BandLab. An instrument definition file will help you organize your patches within the software. So let's get started. You'll want to unzip this file here and I have it ready to go. We'll just extract it to my desktop. Okay, I see it here. All right. Now what you want to do is you want to open up Cakewalk by BandLab. And we're going to go to Edit, Preferences. And then we're going to choose Instruments. You can see I already have an instrument definition file set up for my Motif Rack XS. So to install this file, you'll need to define you're going to need to import and then we're going to go to wherever you put your your file wherever you unzipped it and here it is and there's the file you're looking for you're simply going to click it and open now I'm going not going to do that cuz I don't want to take a chance of screwing up my system but that's it and what I mean by screwing up my system is I already have it installed so just go ahead and click open and then once you do that you're going you're going to choose your ports and then you're just going to select which instrument definition file you want it to associate with you can see mine's going to my MIDI sport 4x4 and I just simply chose it. I could choose that one, but I'm going to leave it here. Okay. And so what this does for you is it gives you uh, access to, let's test. Uh, it gives you access to all of your motif patches at your fingertips. So we're going to look at a MIDI track and it's important that you view all you see how mine's set to custom here you want to choose all so now we see our input our output our channels etc so we're gonna go ahead and uh, I think I have my uh, motif on my B port and then we'll choose you can already see that since I chose B because I know that's where my motif is going that I'll just choose channel 1 here's the really cool thing here's every bank including your user banks for your motif so let's just take a quick look here's the very first one. Oh, special special note here it also includes your general MIDI bank it's a great place to start if uh, you're working with general MIDI files and you're looking to just audition sounds later so um, I'm gonna go ahead and use the uh, rack pre one and this is mainly the bank of pianos and as you can see here's all the pianos that are in, in the rack module and again I'm using the motif rack XS okay same thing if we want to look at the pre 2 so this is a really convenient way to uh, utilize your production workflow and your equipment uh, the the um, files are called dot INS their instrument definition files okay so if we want to look at the drums for example we can go here and here's all of our drum kits and and if you have a already recorded file you can just reassign the sounds to whatever you like okay thank you very much for watching I hope it helps